Good morning, everyone. Um, I want to say hello to all my friends. I apologize for not really like communicating with you guys. You know, you guys are so generous by always saying something positive or giving me more encouragement. And, you know, because I've gotten so busy with just trying to really impact lives and just change the world, I feel, you know, I just forget to just say hello. So I want to say hello, first and foremost, to all my friends. And I will be showing up more. Number two, I'm doing an enema right now. And, um, you know, I still do enemas every day, once or twice a day if I can. And I'm still well, I'm alive, I'm healthy, I feel amazing. I just looked in the mirror this morning and I'm saying my eyes, like I was, a video that I was looking at and the video, I was talking to my friend and he, and I'm looking at him and I'm like looking this way and you see my eyes, you can't see it, but they're very, like they're white. They, my eyes, my inside of my eyes were not white. They were like changing, like they were getting yellow and different things. And I was like, oh, I'm getting old. And again, since my lifestyle changed, it's like I just noticed how the whites of my eyes are even more whiter, more brighter. So I just want to encourage you guys to just know that it's about your health that determines how you look. You know, so much for genetics is more about what are you doing to your body? Because that's what's going to sustain you to be a hundred and something years old. I want to live to be 120 years old. That's the goal. I am going to live to be 120 years old. So if you want to join me, join me and let me teach you how to take care of your body before, you know, so that you can avoid this, you know, the pitfalls that there, you know, that's out there and that I've stumbled on. Um, by getting breast cancer and breast cancer again has changed my life has put me in a position where I am just like on top of the world I feel you know I just have so much information I know so much more I know so much better um, yesterday I posted a video um, of my stool and I'm, sh I'm sure you were going what the hell is wrong with this chick oh my gosh who wants to see that well, it's not for you. That's why. So don't watch it. But I showed it because in the stool, you'll see the parasite. This time, this is like, you know, I've been doing this for about three weeks. Doing a detox parasite. You know, you're going to say detox paradise. But a detox parasite detox. And I've been getting things out every day. And I'm like, good, yeah, like it's coming out and. Wow. And then yesterday, like, you know, I'm like, you know, something said, you know, catch this stool. How I catch my stool is I, you know how you come back home with all these bags from the supermarket? Well, I save them. I've been saving the bags. But I use the white ones and I would poop in the bag. You know, I'd poop in the bag and I'd save it and I'll have a tweezer and, or, or a pencil before I use the pencil. But yesterday I had to get a tweezer because I saw something in it it was like wrapped in it and i was like what the hell is that because i know i've been getting these parasites out where this one come from and as i sent my store to, sent my son to the store to get a tweezer and i put the lamp put it in this bathroom sink opened it up i had a little cup i have little clear cups of water and i um started i felt like a doctor like i felt like a scientist i'm looking through the stool and and I knew that I, I knew that I had quinoa the night before, mushrooms, avocado, and um, yeah. And I'm looking through the stool, and I'm like, "What the hell is this?" It was like the longest, biggest thing I had ever seen, and I was like, "Oh my gosh!" I wait till this call. All right, good. Um, it was the biggest stool ever. I mean, the biggest stool. It was the biggest, longest, I want to say worm, parasite ever that I've ever seen. 
it blew I was in shock shock okay so I want you to know that I'm saying that because and I'm gonna post my post a video on my YouTube channel Ruby Collins TV Ruby Collins TV on YouTube I'm gonna post it on my channel and the reason why because I want you guys to see what it is that you what you're looking for when you move your bowels I'm looking up at my and my bag here I'm doing an organic coffee enema. Ooh. I want you to know how to look for it and what you're looking for, you know, and what it looks like. Because when I go on YouTube to look at, to make sure what I'm getting are parasites. You know, I don't know if I got it, if I'm looking at the right thing. Is that parasite or is that a mucosis or... You know, the stomach lining. I don't know what it is, but I know it's not just my bowel movement. Um, but please watch the video. Someone sent me a video. I forgot her name. She goes, Ruby, you were right about the parasites. 50% of Americans have parasites. So far, everyone that's been come through to my place to be tested on, on my Park, and Park EMD machine, which is 99.9% .9 accurate. They use this machine all over the world, uh, except for America and, you know, in certain places. Um, China, Russia, they're using, the doctors are using it. It shows parasites. We're living with parasites. Um, right now, um, a woman who I'm, I'm, I'm coaching with, uh, not even coaching, but I'm a friend of mine. Um, we're working, you know, she's trying to fight the cancer back. You know, she's really working at it. And she knows, and she's aware, she knows about parasites. And she goes, Ruby, you know, the parasites, they're eating at us, they're stealing our food, their nutrition, they're causing us to be sick, they're pooping toxins in our body. You know, the craving that we have, the candida, which is, you know, parasites and candida are the same, one of the same, because it's the craving of something, and it's the parasite that's craving it, and you think you're hungry, it's not you, it's the parasite. Um... It's unbelievable what these leeches, these parasites, that's why they call it parasites. What? Oh, shit. Hold on. I don't want to. So I'm doing an enema right now. Hold on. Okay, so I'm sorry. Well, I'm not sorry. I'm doing an enema, and what happens is that, you know, you have moments where, like, I find that when I do an enema, I have to be really calm, relaxed. So if I start talking and getting excited, I'm going to want to expel the coffee, the organic coffee that I sent up my colon. And it's going to want to come back out. So anyway, I feel better. I just released a little bit of the water. But I'm going to let the rest stay in there for the remainder of this video. Um, I don't remember what I was talking about, though. Shoot. Well, I know I was talking about the parasites. And the parasites, um, just watch the video. It, it really is killing us. And... All of those aches and pains and things that you can't describe what's happening to your body and you're taking medicine for, is parasites. You got parasites. Um, is there anything wrong with having parasites? No, because we are human beings and we live in this country and we live in, we, we, we're, we're humans and you're going to get something. Um, so there's nothing to be embarrassed about. I'm not embarrassed about it. I'm, I'm excited about it because... I know what to do to take care of my body, to be well, to be healthy, to be vibrant, to be energetic, to be, you know, not sick, to not have aches and pains, to not have um, just a number of things that I was not used to this kind of lifestyle. I thought my life was great before. You guys have no idea. 
what do I use to get rid of these parasites? And I've been doing this cleanse uh, for about three weeks now. I use diatomaceous earth and turpentine. Turpentine, gum, spirit, turpentine. Look it up. Gum, spirit, turpentine. And uh, do the research. I mean... I, you know, I, I know that I should have the information, but you know what? I had to research and I don't remember everything. So look it up and research. Do what I did. It's just way you can know what to do for your body to help heal your body naturally. I'm excited uh, about healing your, like, healing your body naturally. Look it up. Um, I'm excited about... Oh, Wait a minute, there's something I want to say. There's a video that I posted on my Facebook page. Again, this uh, someone from Facebook posted it to me and said, Ruby, you were right. Um, and when I watched this video, it continued to educate me on the parasite, what I already know about parasites. I was excited to just watch this video and I'm going to share it a few more times today because... Um, yeah, I showed you my poop and in my poop, there was the biggest freaking parasite ever. I gotta say big, it was long. And I said, holy cow, I'm still killing them off. Um, you know, you would say, well, Miss Ruby, you're eating well, you're taking vitamins, you're doing all this amazing stuff. Why do you still have parasites? Well, parasites don't just happen. They don't just enter your body and, and, uh, for a short period of time and then leave. I've accumulated, I've probably gotten parasites, you know, maybe 20 years now. They live in your body for decades. Decades. That means five years, 10 years, 15 years, they're living in your body. They are eating, your, robbing you of your food. They are nutrition and everything else. Um, if someone tells you you have a tapeworm and you're eating garbage, you do have a tapeworm. You have a parasite that's eating from you and you need to um, get rid of it and, 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 and detox your body. If you, you know, I can go on in so much other details, but I'm not going to, I want you to watch the video about parasites in this country and being in America or anywhere in the world. Um, so you should be constantly detoxing your body because you get it from everything and anywhere and anything. You know, gym, uh, you know, in the gym, door handles, you name it. Oh my gosh. It was, it was, this video was amazing. So I love you. Thank you for sharing that with me. I'm so glad that I'm so transparent with my life because people get to really connect with me and share um, things because they know that I have spoken about it and it just continues to educate me. Um, so I'm excited. I'm also excited about my new um the, the transition of my RC music place, my music school. Um, on my flyers, I would always have, you know, music school, music lessons, and tutoring. And I'm saying, Ruby, you do so much more and have so much more information to help people. We got to figure out, you know, I couldn't figure out how to combine the music school and my nutrition, you know, and my health and healing and sharing my story with people. So when they come in for a lesson, I would just start, you know, I would talk to them about my, me being a cancer, a cancer fighter, which is a lifestyle, you know. I chose not to do chemotherapy and radiation when the doctors threatened me that I had three children to live for and I was, you know, going to die. This is what she told me over the phone. And, um, and she would call me every day and literally, like, harass me to take chemotherapy. And I, you know, I said no. You know, I declined and I just really dis disregarded her. You know, because it was just like, they were like really very adamant about getting me to do chemotherapy, which I knew already. It's just, you know, it's, it's, it's business, you know, it's business. And I, I there's other ways that I, that I learned and I had to really, you know, believe in God's way or no way. And if that's the case, then I would have to die and I'm not afraid of death. I'm not afraid. So many people have gone before us and we all are going to die, but I'm not going to go and die. 
I'm not gonna let you take me out. That's the bottom line. I'm not gonna let it be you who make the final decision on my life. So that's how I felt. And I'm excited that I've been able to just really heal my body and watch myself go through this transformation, you know, mentally, spiritually, uh, you know, my body and my children and, and just the knowledge I've accumulated is insane. Um, so I'm excited. Um, uh, and I'm also, again, like I said, I'm excited about the transition of my um, business to a place of now being able to educate people in their healing. I met this amazing gentleman who um, I can't believe he's so much like myself. And you know, I'm going to say that you guys know that I'm I'm also a life coach and I have this incredible uh, program. It's a dream builders program, but the name of my company is uh, Mass Movement for Life, and um, which I teach this program to high schools. Uh, I'm a parent coordinator teaching this program. I've been doing this program with individuals coming, you know, my students who come to my place. And I would say, listen, can I use you as my guinea pig? Can I share my program with you? And it's actually changing their lives. And I'm excited about it because it's changed my life and my thinking. Um, so this particular individual came to my life based on my thinking. Oops. Based on how I, you know, now think. And it's exciting Again, because he's just like myself, uh, you know, and I'm excited that he is so, he is so knowledgeable about um, just being able to really take a, a business to another level that he is, you know, agreed to, to partner with me and help me with my business and, and also being able to grow his own business. Uh, he's in a uh, a certified personal trainer. I have somebody who can help me stay in the gym and continue to, um, you know, get the, you know the detoxing exercise that I need to make sure this cancer never comes back. And you know, God sent me someone, so I'm really excited about um, our partnership and um, and our friendship. And uh, I, I, I'm excited. It, it's, you know, it's music, art, and healing. Music, art, and fitness. You know, healing the mind, body, and the soul. And it really is that. It really, really, really is that. You know, so let's, you know, um, I can't really, I mean, it's just, I'm very, very excited. So, with that being said, I love you all. And um, please watch the video on the parasites on my uh, on my Facebook channel someone sent to me it educates you on the parasites that's in your body right now today this morning how I get rid of it I use turpentine, gum turpentine gum, gum spirit turpentine and I use diatomaceous earth and another colon something that pulls parasites out that's about 40 bucks I'll show you that but I really started with the turpentine which I took again this morning so I'm continuing the process. It takes about three months to really get rid of the parasites. Um, so as this video mentioned, and so far it's been like about three weeks to going on a month that I've been getting parasites out every single morning. Every day I'm looking at going, what the hell? This morning I moved my bowels, there's nothing in it. But I, I just, you know, sometimes you stop with the protocol and you wait for them to come back out and you, it's like roach spray, I guess, you know? They kind of hide and they take off and then after all the spraying is done, they come back out. So that's what, that's what the parasites are like. And that's what's living in your body. And I'm going to assume that it's living in your body and just say it because why not just try to heal your body or just clean it by doing something that's amazing? Um, when I was in Mexico, we used something called DMSO and I took that every day intravenous. Look up DMSO. I just put that in my eyes. My eye, you know, it's to clean my eyes, the cataracts. I don't have cataracts, but it's great for cataracts. So you want to look that up. DMSO with your eyes. Anything that I mentioned, just look it up, people, and start Googling it. Do some research. 
it's important that we the, the energy that we take to spend on our jobs and and our families we need to take that time to do a little research to healing our bodies and being the best that we can be for ourselves and for others uh, so yeah i love you all i'm excited god bless you have an amazing day and remember that you know no one loves you more than you you have to love yourself and i love myself I come first, it's God, and me, and then my kids, and anybody else. But my kids is right up there with anybody else, because them kids are a pain in the butt sometimes, I'll tell you right now. But I love my children, and I make sure even my kids ain't going to drive my ass crazy, I'm going to tell you right now. I don't do that. Because these kids, you know, they could be a little ungrateful, because they don't understand they're young. So you make sure you love yourself, and... Heal your body and, and, and in conjunction, oh, well, in addition to, not in conjunction, but in addition to teaching your family how to take care of themselves as well. All right. Love you all and be well. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. Remember, choose health, choose life. That's my company. Choose health, choose life. And exodus for life. Exodus for Life. That's my partnership, and we are teaching people how to incorporate music and fitness. <laughs>